Welcome! This video provides an overview of how to navigate the newly launched viewing environment for items in the Stanford Digital Repository. At this time, the upgraded viewer, which leverages Mirador 3, supports all image file format types, while audio, video, 3D, and PDF files are still delivered using the existing viewer. The viewer displays for all images in the Stanford Digital Repository, and any SDR images published in SearchWorks and or in Spotlight at Stanford. It is important to note that the access rights of each item in the Stanford Digital Repository will change the nature of your interactions with the viewer. You will be asked to log in for content that has Stanford-only restrictions, and zoom and download of content will also be governed by the restrictions that are in place for the item. Let's look at a multi-page image in the new viewer. Please note this item has world viewing and unrestricted download rights. Starting in the upper left-hand corner, you'll see that you have the opportunity to click and enable display of the left-hand sidebar. Click on the arrow to expand the sidebar and click again to hide the expanded view. To make the sidebar disappear altogether, click again on the toggle sidebar button. Click on the arrow in the sidebar header to move the sidebar to the right-hand side of the viewer. Click the X in the sidebar header to close. Let's briefly review the sidebar content. Information includes the persistent URL, image-specific metadata when present, other descriptive metadata, and the IIIF manifest URL. Rights contains copyright and access information. Index contains a thumbnail list for multi-page items, as well as a list of pages. See the page navigation bar at the bottom of the viewer. Use the buttons to zoom in or out, reset the zoom, and page forward and back. Let's move to the upper right-hand corner of the viewer. Here are the window display and thumbnail view options. Items can be viewed as single pages, book view, or gallery view. Thumbnail view can be displayed at the bottom of the viewer or on the right-hand side, and thumbnail display can be toggled off. The window options menu is where to find the share and download options. For the share menu, Share provides the persistent URL to the item in the Stanford Digital Repository. Embed provides the code to copy and paste into a blog post or other publishing platform, which embeds the viewer. The smallest size is selected by default, but you can select from three other sizes. Click the size you want and then copy the embed code. Drag and drop the IIIF manifest icon to display the item in a IIIF compatible comparison viewer, such as Mirador. For the download menu, you can download the entire image as a JPEG file or a downscaled JPEG. Additional sizes may be available. If you are zoomed in, a download button will appear when the region is of downloadable size as a JPEG file. If you are viewing an item in book view, you will have the option to download the left-hand page or the right-hand page. Please remember that download options are governed by the rights assigned to each item. At a minimum, a thumbnail no longer than 400 pixels on the long edge is always downloadable as this is considered to be item metadata according to Stanford Library's policy. Other downloads and zoom may be restricted. Lastly, the full screen view option can be selected if desired for an enhanced view of the item. Reclick the option to return to the regular size viewer. If you have questions or comments, please use the feedback link in the upper right hand corner of the page whether you are on a Perl page, in SearchWorks, 
or in a spotlight exhibit. Thank you for watching.